Well, guys, today we are going to talk about the future of fusion tech, the tokamak. Tokamak is a device used to confine plasma in a toroidal magnetic field to create a situation where nuclear fusion takes place. Now, what is nuclear fusion? It is the process by which two nitre nuclei combine to form a heavier nuclei. The heavier nucleus has a mass less than the sum of the masses of the lighter nucleus. The lost mass is converted into energy, tremendous energy, given by the Einstein's famous equation E equals mc square. The tokamak is a device that would help us harness this tremendous amount of green energy. In nuclear fission, the energy created is about four times the energy created in nuclear fission. For fusion to occur, we need to reach temperatures near to that of the sun. This is where the tokamak comes up. We use a mixture of deuterium and tritrium hydrogen isotopes as fusion fuel. This is transformed in a plasma and confined magnetically in the tokamak under moderately high pressure for long periods of time to reach the fusion temperature. Now, how can plasma be confined? What is magnetic confinement? Magnetic confinement or magnetic confinement of charge is the method by which charges can be confined within the magnetic field. Charges experience a force given by F is equal to Q V cross T, where Q is the charge of the particle, V is the velocity of the charge, and B is the magnetic field vector in the space where the charge moves. Firstly, this force makes the charge spiral around the magnetic field lines and the net travel of the charge is along the magnetic field lines. Secondly, in a region where the field lines are converging, there will be a component of this force away from the region, forcing the charge to spiral back from where they came. Charges can be confined using two magnetic dipoles in the shape of a bottle. An extended idea is a toroidal magnetic confinement which keeps the charges spiraling along the magnetic field lines. This concept is used in our so-called tokamak to confine the plasma used for nuclear fusion. The largest tokamak is being built in ITER. It would be completed by 2024 and operational by 2035. It aims in understanding the properties of matter during fusion and in future commercialize fusion as a source of green energy. In the tokamak, plasma is first inserted and trapped via magnetic field. Then high energy deuterium gas is injected, which collide with the lower energy plasma, increasing its energy and density. This helps in raising the temperature to millions of degrees required for fusion. The fusion energy would be a green energy. There would be little waste produced. The only waste is the radio effect of metal components in the tokamak that become harmless within 100 of years. Unlike fission, which produce radio waves that takes thousands of years to decay. I am talking about the plutonium waves that takes about 6,000 to 10,000 years to decay, roughly. That's all about tokamak. Hope you guys liked it. Please like, share and comment.